Okay, I know what you want. I know what you want. You want super toad sunshine. The encore. Welcome to Weird Sanix. Oh, what the fuck? Already? Atomic Sonic is first. What a start. <laughs> I don't like that. Alright, here we are. Finally. Finally I can begin. I may have to configure the controls. Give me just another second. We, we have yet another weird Sanix delay. Um, I have to figure out what I'm going to do for the shoulder buttons. Start right, left, down, up. You ready? Oh, why is it so horrible? <laughs> it just hurts to look at. So this is Weird Sonic. This is a collection from two separate people who made me the weirdest Sonic fan games, let's say, that they could find. And whoever you are, thank you for making these. And, um, I already hate it. What do we do to wish this hell upon ourselves? Maybe it was for the best that Weird Sanix got delayed two weeks in a row. And you know, I may have a Spooptober treat. If we if we can make it through this, I may have a little Spooptober thing. I've got a number of Spooptober Sundays planned, but this'll... I'll give you a short one. So please, try to survive. If you can, if you can make it through this, then we, we will get to something even more... appropriate. Alright, well that was Atomic Sonic, I guess? This one's called Big Fishin'... Big's Fishin' Derby. So here's Big the Cat. A character I've only become made aware of very recently. Hang on a second, the start button is fast forward, I have to change that real quick. Um... Much better. Zen mode? Start playing? So, I guess this is... Fishing? Did you know Big the Cat is John St. John? I think I knew that at some point. Now I know for sure. So Duke Nukem is also Big the Cat. What? So, so this is it? This is... I, I mean... It's not as relaxing as Stardew Valley, but I'll take it. It's actually kind of legit. Do I need to catch a frog? Oh, the frog was the key to all this, because the frog is a funnier character than we've ever had. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, you fucker, you ate my frog. Yeah, this is pretty good. I mean, you know, for a minigame. This isn't something I would spend a lot of time on, but... Surprisingly... Surprisingly interesting and innovative for a, a weird Sanic. Damn it. 
was hoping I could really cheese that out. By the way, there's um, a documentary on Netflix that made me want to die. So I want to warn you. It contains, like, really, really graphic imagery, and it'll, it'll really fuck you up. So, I want you to not- I want to tell you about it, I want to warn you about it, so that you don't watch it. Alright? It really made me think about a lot of things, and- and put a- like, a fucking existential crisis into my head. I mean, my fatalism has never been worse after watching this documentary. Um... Truly God is dead, you know, and all that fun stuff. It's called Tokyo Idol. And it's about Japanese idols and the old men that follow them around. Just remember, handshaking... Handshaking is very sexual. Bubsy in Sonic 2 is next. There he is! The original Cool Cat. Wow. Look, he's got- <laughs> He controls very similar to his- Oh. Oh, it's insta-death. I'll tell you what could possibly go wrong. The game could suck. As much as I have a problem with the way Sonic controls, Bubsy is at least three times worse. But at least you get this nice glide. Doesn't Knuckle have the glide? Okay, I'm I'm actually I'm I'm impressed with getting Bubsy in Sonic and actually making it work well. But this would definitely make the game even more difficult. Wait, what? Why are you dead? Oh god, there's fall damage. Bubsy has, like, tiny, small amounts of fall damage. What sicko would make something like this? When I say uh, small amounts of fall damage, I mean, Bubsy can't fall from a large height without, you know, being removed from the mortal coil. It's... It's quite pathetic. Dead. That's the fall damage, right there. Could you imagine? I mean, I know Bubsy's a different game and, and you know, you're gonna want Sonic to play a Sonic uh, level, but... Could you imagine having to play Sonic... ...with that level of fall damage? These are just death springs. Wow. Vinny, did you notice the level name? No. That- come on, no way. You have to glide down. On at least complete one level. My job here is done. Dr. Robotnik's Creature Capture. Sega. This is a nice collection. Considering I've, I've played a lot of Mario... ...fan games and ROM hacks and all that, and plenty of other games too. But, not too much Sonic. I've played... ...more Sonic, like, shitty fan games in Game Maker, as opposed to actual, like... ...mods. So, this is kinda cool. Dr. Robotnik's Creature Capture. That's not Bugs Bunny, is it? Totally original bunny, do not steal.
Welcome to Green Hill Zone. So I'm, I'm assuming this is the story of Robotnik before the Sanic games. This is how so this is <laughs> this is how Robotnik captured the animals before the Sonic series. This is fucking amazing. I am actually really impressed. Oh, you can only capture one at a time. Yo, Eggman. Pr promotion. How do I deposit the bunny? Oh, there we go. No. So yeah, you get more time. And then you must capture these poor innocent ra uh, animals, rabbits, ducks, anything. Anything that could possibly power the Robotnik machines. That's pretty cool. Uh, my chat froze. I don't even know if I'm live anymore. This happens from time to time. It's never my favorite. I, I don't know if I'm live anymore. Yeah, I'm dropping frames. Probably talking to no one. Let's see, I hit refresh. And I'm good. Well, Weird Sanix is canceled yet again. I think that was a Vine Ryzen moment. I'm not entirely sure what happened there, but I think I just talked shit about Japanese idols and someone didn't like that. John Twitch was not okay with us. But anyway, I'm back. Uh, let's hope the internet can maintain just until weird Sanics are done. So I never have to say that words again. All both of that words. And the stream has frozen yet again. Yeah, I'm dropping frames like a motherfucker. It's a good night for this Verizon. Quality night for this. Have mercy, Verizon, please. Okay, the, um, I'm sorry, I was just, uh, I was torrenting 13 gigs of Japanese idol performances, and it was messing with my internet connection. Sorry, everybody. Uh, hopefully it's better now. Uh, thank you for your patience. I hope the stream can not die, Verizon. You hear me? This one's called I Hog Hate That Hedgehog. What? Oh, it's just backwards. It's it's mirrored. <laughs> oh, I'm okay. Excuse me, I just <laughs> I had a tickle in my throat. It's just Sonic backwards. Uh, the level doesn't appear to be backwards. Everything else seems to be- oh my god. Everything's mirrored. Controls are backwards. Oh no. Oh, this is fucking impossible. Really? 
really nothing changed as far as I can tell. And I, I can't really tell because I'm not that big of a Sonic... I don't know if you knew this <laughs> from watching my streams, but I'm not that big of a Sonic fan. But yeah, the controls are reversed, the level's mirrored, everything's totally reversed. Until now. Oh, every time you hit one of these... Okay, I'm- I'm good. Just a challenge. Just this challenge, welcome to Param Zone, a maze of pure confusion that's ensured to leave your- tearing your hair out. Your goal, find the exit, time amount unlimited, rings required, none. Good luck. Just a maze? Do a soon dash? I don't know what that means. It's just a big, confusing maze. Also, if anyone is having trouble with the stream, if the stream goes down again, just refresh the page and hopefully it'll come back up. I think it's just Verizon shitting the bed tonight, so... Someone in chat just said, I've never completed this. That's not encouraging. Finna boing pad? I guess so. Someone asked me recently for... I, every now and then someone will ask me for a quote for their yearbook. And, um... So I gave them options. The first option was... If you don't... If you're ashamed of doing the things you love, you don't deserve to do them. Something like that. And then the second one was Finna Boing. Which one do you think they're gonna go with? I mean, I can see people getting into this. I'm a little bored. Let's go on to Kirby. In Sonic 1. Hi. Maybe, maybe finally I'll like Sonic games if I just if I just play it like this. No. You get one jump. It's not entirely Kirby. You can't you can't suck. There's no suck. Holy shit, Kirby's even faster than Sonic. Yeah, this is not legit Kirby. I'm sorry to say that this is somewhat of a disappointment. You can't suck in Kirby 1 either. Yes, you can. In Kirby's Dreamland on the Game Boy, I, yeah, you can you can suck enemies and then you <laughs> then you spit them out. You don't get their powers. I press all button. Every button has been pressed, no suck. Down plus A equals suck. So wait, let me get this straight. There's six face buttons on the Sega Genesis, but I have to press down A to suck? There's suck. You have to press down A to do it. Almost a legit suck. Three on the original? Oh, I see. Gotcha. The six came later in Genesis's life. Oh, okay. See, I didn't actually know that. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um... It's- it's alright. It's Kirby. It's, it doesn't really play like Kirby. You don't have infinite jump. 
Oh man. You can't suck in the air. So there's there's some limitations, but for what it is, I give it credit. It's um that's alright. Next is Mr. Needle Mouse. What in the name of Christ is going on? What is this? I tried to do level select. Oh, okay, so this is uh, Mr. Needle Mouse. The world is corrupted and looks like ass, but Mr. Needle Mouse is super realistic. Good animation. Look at that. Look at that walk animation up the up the, up the hill. <laughs> it goes upside down every now and then. It just turns into a blot of ink. Jeez. Is this original tunes? It's not. Oh, it's Labyrinth Zone? I see. Look at him go. I mean, for the most part, it looks kind of normal-ish. It's just when you do this, you go upside down. Otherwise, the loops are fine. More or less. All right, <laughs> Mr. Needle Mouse, there you go. Oh, Jesus. Here's one. I'm not going to tell you the name of this one. I need you to see it for yourself, okay? Right? It's, a com it's almost Comic Sans. Yep, it's Pepsi Man. There's, there we go. Now, when I said Pepsi Man, I meant it's just Pepsi. It is just a can of Pepsi. I'm still streaming. People are having problems yet again with internet. Of course, the one time I went... Finally, I get to do Weird Sanix, and the internet's all fucked up. But yeah, it's, it's real... Oh no! Look, look at that. Look at that. Oh no! Oh no! Do you see what happens when I when I kill an enemy?
Yep. I have no idea what's happening with my internet. I thought I was live for the past five minutes. So that's cool. The chat was working, everything was fine. I'm just trying to play... a uh, Sonic Pepsi Man game, but I'm not even Pepsi Man, I'm just a pe can of Pepsi. Like, come on, I finally do Weird Sanix. It takes this long. And then internet. And the internet's fucked again. There it goes again. Yep, it has comedic timing, that's for sure. It's getting spicy today. Vappy's gonna have a good time putting this one together. Pikachu the mouse. I guess I'm back. Apparently, Verizon has very good comedic timing. Because whenever I complain about it, it just goes offline again. Anyway, here's a bootleg Pikachu. Pikachorp. I can't jump. Oh wait, now I can. back. I'm not even gonna say anything. I'm not gonna say, I hope this works, I hope the internet doesn't shit out. I tweeted the meme to Verizon, but just remember kids, paying for a shitty internet is no good when you're a streamer. It is my understanding that I lost about, uh, let's see, 6,000 viewers? Maybe it was intentional, maybe I just wanted to bleed the viewers. Maybe Weird Sanix is cursed. I think Weird Sanix is cursed. Anyway, um, anyway, you'll notice I'm Pikachu, <laughs> so... Pikachu has a very interesting move, which is, you can go fast in the air, like extra fast. Again, is another case of someone being faster than Sonic. How will this affect Vappy and Full Sauce? I think, well, if you're watching this on Full Sauce, keep in mind Vappy probably Fix it up. Nice. Hot. Pikachu has passed. Rest in peace. I think what Vappy will do is get the raw file from me, and then combine it, and... I don't know, a miracle? 
just miracles. Wait, am I supposed to be able to, like... Oh. Yeah, I mean, you'll see there's a lot of uh, similarities between this and the other weird Sanix involving another meme character. Which is, it's just Sonic, but with meme character. And meme character is faster than Sonic. And has more moves than Sonic. Sorry, Sonic. Sonic has been displaced as the king of speed. Pikachu is a meme? Pikachu could be a meme. It could very well be a meme. Here's Portal Gun in Sonic the Hedgehog. Sega. Remember, kids. Mod your favorite games into Sonic. Yep. <laughs> Lay cake. There was like some Ghost Hunter video or some Ghost Hunter TV show where they went into this basement and on the whiteboard it said the cake is a lie. And they were like, we did not do that. There's been activity in this house. We did not do that. And he tried to explain um, what the ghosts might have meant by saying the cake is a lie. Christ, how the fuck? This is kind of cool, actually. No, really, it's, it's a real vi- I'm- listen, it's a real video. Oh my god, I'm back here? I'll show you. I'll show you the video, just give me a second. As much as I can help it, I try to not tell tall tales here on the stream. Because there are, like, a couple thousand viewers almost at all times, and it would be really easy for me to get caught in a tall tale. So, I, I understand that the validity of my information will be questioned at all times, so, you know. That said, a short tale could be fun. You know, like, every now and then you just tell a, a short tale. And then tell that it's, you know, fake later. Ghost Hunter, um, cake is a lie. Let's see. Let me show you. Let me show you just a moment, just so you can see what these ghost hunters are doing with their lives. Now, I'm sure it's a fine hobby, but... Historically, Jim says, means the promised reward never... A message brawlers proved to his toughest and still don't think their brawl is over, even a century later. Look at this. Focus on this chalkboard. Other paranormal signs, Jim says, a message on a chalkboard, which wow. was once part of that basement jewelry business. Someone or something, he says, wrote this message. The cake is a lie. Which historically, <laughs> Jim says, means the promised reward never happened, meaning somebody down here isn't very happy. And oh, four no. years ago, Jim says he had his team psychic write this question on the board. What is your name? Six months later, we came back and found Matty. We didn't write it. Back upstairs, members... As if no one could enter the house. Like, the ghost hunters did, <laughs> didn't write it, but no one else could possibly enter the house. The promised reward would never come. Beautiful. Look at Sonic. After that video, Sonic is just totally fucking completely bored. Like, come on! Even Sonic knows better. Come on. Maddie. This is Somari 16-bit. And we've done, um... We've done Somari on the NES. This is the Genesis version of Somari. Also, um... You know, the other side. It said messages from the other side. 
So I'm going to blow a couple of people's minds. I'm sure most of you are aware of this. I'm sure most of you understand the why did the chicken cross the road joke. But if you didn't, I'm going to explain the joke. You ready? To get to the other side because the chicken dies in the road. I know. This isn't working, by the way. Samari is not working. Yep, there are a number of people who didn't actually know that. <laughs> yeah. Happy Spooptober to you too. This doesn't work. That is sad. Samari 16-bit with Mushroom Kingdom level. Thinny, thanks to you, I now understand comedy. Well, hang on a minute. Can can you can you tell me how to understand comedy? It's not exactly my strong point. Vinny, I always thought it was just kind of an anti-joke. Yeah, for a little while I did too. I guess it's all a lie. The promised reward has never come. Um, the sad news is Somari is not working. And I'm, I'm really upset about that because it would have been great if anyone... Well, I don't know what to play it on. I think it's just Genesis, but it's not working. So we'll try Sonic 1 Boomed. I don't know if this has any relation to the Sonic Boom, which was um, generally critically considered to be the best Sonic game of the past 10 years. So if you've never played Sonic, then I would recommend starting with Sonic Boom, of course. Oh, I got it. Here it is, Samari. <laughs> Could you imagine this happened uh, 25 years ago? Wow. No shit. This is impressive. <laughs> this is really impressive. It looks like New Super Mario Brothers too. Oh, there's a a bonus jump. I don't know. This this Mario sprite is making me kind of uncomfortable though. Look at it. Ah, oh, it's too weird. It's too like semi-realistic. Mario Brothers theme with Genesis sound capabilities. Also making me slightly uncomfortable, but still a pretty good job. Vinny, it's Wario in disguise. Look at that smug face. What if it was Wario? Look at that. Look at that face. That was Mario's reaction after the chicken crosses the road joke was explained to him. Vinny, double jumping will now forever be known as bonus jumping. Well, well, hang on a minute. It's not technically a double jump because you don't press the jump button. It was, it was, um, you gotta press a different button to get the second jump. And it's not even like a true double jump. It's like a spin. sprites are for almost falling off a ledge. Oh, here we go. There's another stank face. Alright, guys, we've got a fidget spinner. Oh, I can do backflips? This, this is very intricate. This is the best Somari game I've ever played. 
And I've played a couple Samari games, as surprising as that may be. Wow. Wow! Get a couple of different moves. It's my one ring. Please don't take that away from me. That's all I have. Kirby and this were done by the same person. Very, very good. This person knows how to make good Sonic ROM hacks. I'm even afraid to say the word ROM hack sometimes. People like that, um, that takedown button. You'll notice my reticence towards saying ROM hack when I do <coughs> fan games made, modded from the original game engine. I wonder if, um, if there's a level select here. And if so, I wonder if other Mario levels were modded into this. Vinny, it's okay, Sega isn't evil. Hang on a minute. Sonic- it was, Sega's taken down some hacks, too. I'm sure the chat has the information. I've been told there was a situation one time. Or another. Is there a level select here? This is the only level? Oh, okay. Never mind then. Streets of Rage remake got a, a cease and desist. Okay, so then... Less litigious, for sure. And I know the Sonic Mania team is pretty much... Like, that's pretty much just a ROM hack. Being a role model is overrated. I'd much rather be... Hilariously edgy. Oh god. Here it is. <laughs> Sonic... Sonic boomed. Let's do it! Oh no. Oh no. Oh god, no! Does this happen with everything? Yes, it does. <laughs> Is this what Sonic Boom was actually like? It's like they're drawn to me. Just for me. <laughs> One more ring to rule them all. It's like they're drawn to me. Uh. Rings! Please stop. Please shut up. No, it was worse. Hey, look at all these rings. Time to rev the engine. Look at all these rings! Oh. Rings! The player might get bored if we don't have a voice clip every, uh, two seconds. It's like a modern-day horror movie. If you don't get in at least one jump scare per five minutes, then the audience gets bored. Really? Bouncy, bouncy. Here's a bounce pad. It was worse because you had three more characters that spoke. Whoever played through that whole game, you you have my blessing. I I respect you. And I, I hope you're okay. Sonic with fries. 
<laughs> okay, I don't know what I'm in for. It's just a city. Here we go, the next... the next iteration of the Sonic main series has to take place in an edgy, like, um, you know, graffitied up city. It would be great if Sonic would say things about his, like, scrotal warts, but... Speaking of, uh, warts, new Nathan for you. Tight. Tight. Yeah, warts! Yeah, there's- there's just not enough voice. There's not enough voice clips. I don't know, guys, I'm getting kind of bored. I need Sonic to tell me how he's feeling, how he's thinking. Sonic, you never tell me how you feel anymore. I don't know, I just feel like... I just feel like... All the years we put in... Now you don't talk to me! You don't communicate, Sonic! This is Sonic 2 XL. I don't know what that means. Um, <laughs> I, I couldn't tell you what's different, so if anyone knows what's different... Oh. Oh, I see what's different. All right, now. I ate too many rings. What the fuck? What is happening? I, oh no! I ate too many rings! Wait, so... Every time I have a ring... Every time I collect rings, Sonic gets a little thicker. Now this is the he-thick sequel that I've been waiting for. Look at that. Look at that. This is a masterstroke. Even when you lose the rings, you, you can't... <laughs> you can't get rid of... <laughs> They're onion rings. Oh no, I can't even get up there. Thanks, Tails, you gotta help me. Tails, please, now. Wait, the more you run, the more weight you lose. This is what I'm being told. I'm not sure yet. Let's just keep going. Yep, it's- it's legit. It's legit. Oh no. Oh no. I can't get over there. I can't- I can't get over this! What kind of... What kind of monster would make this? And there's not a single chili dog in sight. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's just avoid rings, but then how the fuck do you avoid all the rings? Look, look, look! You don't have a choice most of the time! Revolutionary game mechanics, yeah. Maybe, maybe this is what Sega could be- oh, oh, I, I think I- Yeah, I'm good. Maybe this is the direction Sega wants to go in with their main series. Even completing one level is difficult. But I did it. Yeah, it's like a challenge hack. It's just extra challenge. Wow. This is Sonic Leet. Wow. That was the, probably as stupid as that was. That was one of the more creative ROM hacks I've played tonight. Help me, God. Help all of us. Um, this is Sonic Leet, and it's just. I guess it's a recolor. This may as well be Corruptions.
Okay. I don't know what the point of this is. Just, like, sick, vibrating neon colors? Is that it? it it's really not fun. None of this is fun. It hurts my eyes. Sonic in Colored Zone. Jesus. Oh boy. Oh my god. Here we go again. I've turned into a ring. <laughs> Again, no idea what's happening. Address error? I mean, I'm turning into different monster. This is like a debug thing. <laughs> I'd say of all the weird Sanix tonight, this truly fits the description weird Sanix more than the, any of the other ones. Sonic microtransactions. This all oh, this is going to be good. Buy points to unlock the features. Airhorn Remix. No, 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 put me through, put me through. I want Airhorn Remix. Play a better game. <laughs> Play a better game, huh? Color debug mode? I think I already just did that. Oh, I don't have the speed DLC. I can't go fast. The button... <laughs> the button is non-functional. You must pay to go fast. There's fun DLC. Speaking of fun DLC, did you guys hear about the, um... Battlefront 2? Star Wars Battlefront 2 microtransactions? There's like a playable beta, and the crates have items that aren't just aesthetic in them, but actually, like, game-changing things. So, through those microtransaction crates, you earn cards that affect the gameplay and make you more powerful. So you can be the same level of skill as someone else, but if you paid a lot of money, you can get a lot of cards to make you better and more powerful. Unlock Spin Dash. Extended Camera. Hmm. Lel, I cunt right. Right. Yeah, I mean, you can unlock them through just playing the game. You know, you can play through the game and you'll eventually unlock crates like most games, but... In this case, since the stuff isn't just aesthetic, you'll end up, you know, earning, like, cards and... Apparently gameplay-changing items that can make you more powerful. So that means if someone drops a hundred bucks, they're more likely to have better shit than you. 
that's that's what I, I listen. I could be relaying the information improperly, but that is my understanding of it. I haven't played it. Anyway, I don't know how to cheat and get more points in this. And I, I don't have any Sonic crates. Yo, Eggman. Eggman. I wonder if I get a bunch of points for defeating Eggman. I'm gonna try, just to see if I can unlock a better game. Keep in mind, I actually beat half of this game with Marissa. Leveling up is also tied to how many cards you have, not, not matches played. Corrupt more coins? Alright, well, you know what? I've, I've given up. I'm obviously ill-equipped to defeat Smegman. So I'm just gonna try to corrupt coins. Did I win yet? I think I did it. <laughs> I think I did it. Illegal instruction. All right, let's continue. Sonic Multi. if this is just a Sonic multiplayer thing. Oh, what the fuck? Um, infinite rings? Oh, infinite enemy- <laughs> Oh my god, really? Who in their right mind would create something like this? There we go, there's the slowdown. There's the slowdown. Oh, there's the enemies. Why, why am I die? I, I don't understand why I'm dying. You can't get more than 250 rings. Holy shit. Yeah, there's, there's an actual ring overflow. <laughs> I like have to form a path. There we go. That's it. Now I can't get any rings. Yep. Good. <laughs> Infinite. Infinite fish. Thank god. Okay, good. Now I can actually play through. But the question is, do I want to? I wanna go faster. Illegal integer overflow. Too many rings. Very interesting. Alright, this one's called Sonic Tetris.
Play Sonic 1 with Tetris Special Stages. Let's do Marathon. It, okay, it's just two games in one. And the special stages are Tetris. No, I don't want Sonic music. I want Tetris music in the style of Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, it's- it's Tetris. Sonic the Hedgehog Bounce. Sega. Bean Machine. I like Bean Machine. I like Puyo's better. Vinny, you're not gonna try out Battlefront 2? I might. Let's see when the game comes out. M maybe, um... This microtransaction thing will have been resolved, or it won't be so bad. Maybe the game itself will be good. Maybe this single-player campaign will be really good. And I'll be able to enjoy that. This is a really... original take on Sonic. I cannot deny that. It's just bouncing. can't fucking stop bouncing. There we go. Maybe you shouldn't give EA money. Oh. I mean, you could you could give whoever you want money or not. I dis I don't disagree. Oh. Telling me how to live my life. E. A.'s cock. It's up your ass. See, you have to understand. There's a con there's a bit of a conflict in my brain about the uh, about the thing because, on one hand, maybe. It has a really good single-player campaign. Oh. Okay, this is called Sonic and the Mega Mushroom. So... that's... yep. That's what it is. It's new Super Mario Brothers, but with very, very large, thick Sonic. So, yeah, on one hand, I'm, I'm really conflicted because I don't want to support that business practice. <laughs> I don't want to give them money if they're doing really, really scummy shit with microtransactions. But, on the other hand, what if it's a good single-player campaign? I don't- I don't know what to do. It's very conflicting. I want you to- I want you to know. I'm conflicted. Titanfall 2 has good single-player and multiplayer, also doesn't have shitty gameplay changes, loot boxes. Yeah, Titanfall 2 is excellent. Titanfall 2 is great. There was no microtransactions, there was no bullshit, it was just an excellent single player. It's like everything Call of Duty didn't do, it did right. Like, everything Call of Duty turned away from. It was in- it was unique. It had some really cool game mechanics. It had good boss fights. Um, the multiplayer was... Everything that sh was shitty about Titanfall 1, they- they fixed and added more and then said, you know what? No microtransactions. Why can't they do that for Battlefield? Oh, cause they know they're gonna make millions of dollars off of people who want to have a better blaster. So- so that they can win because they don't want to level. Also, I don't know what this ROM hack is, but I hate it. Sonic the Hedgehog versus Danny DeVito. There are microtransactions in Titanfall 2 now, but it's all cosmetic. Oh. Okay. Well. At least it's optional. Of course, the one I want to play 
doesn't work. Play Battlefield 2 so we don't have to buy it. That's an interesting way to look at that. But what if it's poop? What if it comes out and it's poop and I don't want to play it? What the hell? Yeah, I've played poop. That's a good point. Um, yeah, look at what I'm playing now. Seriously, Th this is a shame. I, I fucking, again, a really great title, but it doesn't work. That's weird, Sanix. Thomas was everywhere. This is <laughs> Sonic the Very Useful Engine. <laughs> it caught me off guard. I was looking I was looking for the Thomas <laughs> relation, but it's yeah, it's there it's <laughs> It's the enemies. It's the flowers. It's everything but Sonic. That's nice. Isn't that nice? This legitimately won a Sonic ROM hack hacking contest, really? Got to stop. Oh man, even the blocks are Thomas. told to get to a boss. You know, you don't get to go a whole lot of fast in, in Sonic 1 at times. That speedball maneuver, I don't know what it's called. I'm calling it speedball, which I know is just... Isn't that just cocaine? Anyway. The speedball maneuver was a very welcome addition to the series. Spin dash. Oh, okay. Yeah, I like how Sonic does um, speedballs and goes extremely fast. You have to be, I guess you gotta be rolling. Yeah. Come on, I need, I need to get to a Robotnik. It, it better be good. It better be worth it. Oh boy. Remember, I've only ever played Sonic 3, so this is... All of this is very new to me. I guess this is my Sonic game for the year and then some. Here we go. Here we go. It's... I don't... I don't know. <laughs> uh... I'm not exactly a Thomas aficionado, so I don't I don't know which character this is. I'm sure many of you do. I 
It's just the conductor. Okay. Now, which one was Ringo Star? Sir Topham Hat, the conduct conductor. Great. Next up, Sonic VR. Um, I guess zero. Hold right to win. How much does that cost? And I'm out of Gucci. Okay, not nothing is happening. This doesn't work on Bizhawk. Okay. Okay, we're gonna come back to this one. This one's Sonic Neko. We'll come back to this one. At the end. Get ready. Oh no. No. Oh! Make it stop. Good morning, Zone. Yeah, now we're fast. This, this should be the default speed of all Sonic games. Amazing. This is before it was a meme? Really? So this is an older one then. Good. This is just a music showcase hack? Okay. Yeah, because it's not really giving me... It's not really giving me a whole lot of options for gameplay. <laughs> Uh, all right, all right. Yoshi in Sonic 2. So we had Kirby, we had Mario, now we've got Yoshi. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's cool. I'm already impressed. Holy shit! They got the eggs down too? No shit! Alright, this is genuinely amazing. I think this is the best one of the night so far for me. This, this has to be the best of the night. At least, and Sonic doesn't even cry. But touch Fuzzy, get dizzy. I want touch Fuzzy. Holy shit, even the touch fuzzy get dizzy is intact! This gets my vote. Yes, even better than Sonic with cheeseburgers. Even better than Sonic duplicates everything. And so far, it's better than Sonic VR. There's even flowers and everything? Um, yeah, maybe maybe even better than Sonic eats rings and, and you know, can't run as fast anymore. Whatever the name of that one was. 
extra thick Sonic XL. Okay, that looks a little silly. Oh, we get the different colored Yoshis, too. It really does marry the best of both worlds. You get the best of Yoshi, the best of Sonic, and, uh... It just really works nicely. Somehow they work well together. I don't really get it, but they do. Here. Let's see what happens. I love the way Sonic bleeds rings. That's awesome. <laughs> Wait, which Sonic was that? That was a Sonic that someone definitely recognizes. This one's called Xanok Bizer. That was Metal Sonic, okay. Alright. That- that was fucking awesome! I would recommend anyone try that just for fun. Because that was good, and it played really well, too. So if you're looking for something to do, you're bored, you're a Sonic fan, you're a Yoshi's Island fan, just do that. Um... The music is a little fucked up here, but... fast. Not really... Yeah, it's just you just go really fast. Wow. You go- <laughs> you go faster than the screen can keep up. Which leads to death. <laughs> um... <laughs> I corrupted it! Hmm. But why does Sonic climb the mountain? Wait... What? I... There's an aesthetic button. How did this happen? Things have certainly changed. Um, if, the, actually, no, it's not a button. That was just a cutscene, I guess. I don't, I don't know what the fuck that was, but it's it's over now, I think. When you go so fast that your world turns vaporwave. And I'm not nearly as fast as I was before. Sonic has truly passed a kidney stone. Damn it. Oh, that's a shame. All my impressive super speed is gone. Okay, listen, we need to do Sonic VR. I think I have the thing that can play Sonic VR. So please bear with me for just a second. And... I hope this works. Oh, you can't see anything. I can't even capture. I can't capture this. Um, yeah, so far... Not working. Okay, so I can't capture it, and it doesn't work with Jen's 
very well. Let's see what it looks like on YouTube. Okay, so it's not all that impressive looking. Here it is. Eh. It's no Yoshi's Island, Sonic. All right, so that's um that's weird Sanix. That's weird Sanix. I hope you enjoyed it. It's finally done. 3 weeks in the making. And it's finally over. So, my favorites were Sonic XL just because it was so stupid. Um the Bubsy one was really funny. Kirby was kind of cool. Obviously Yoshi was the best. Um so Mari was fucking incredible. Really nice collection. Oh, tried to veto. Well, I can't capture the other one. So it's not going to work. I can describe it. Maybe. Let's see. Sonic versus Danny DeVito. Let's see. It doesn't work here either. It just doesn't load. All right, we'll fucking YouTube that too then. <laughs> Sonic versus Danny DeVito. I'm probably gonna get some Newgrounds Flash animation from 1999. Um. Wow. Yeah, no. No, there's no information. This this could just be a jape. Load it onto the real hardware, Vin. What the hell? I don't know what that means. I don't have a... I don't have a Genesis hanging around. I don't know how to transfer it to a cartridge. I will learn. I will learn how to transfer it to a real cartridge, and then I will get a Genesis. But yeah, Jens doesn't work, um, BizHawk doesn't work, and that's that's about as much as I've got. So I think we're going to pass on that one. And no, I'm not going to research. I'll tell you what, if you guys find it online and you can, anyone wants to make a, a video of it, please let me know. Kega Fusion. Okay. I'll try it. Something tells me this isn't going to be worth it. In fact, one of the things I noticed was it said Needle Mouse, so I think it might just be a copy of Needle Mouse, and I think it's just Japes. I do. I think it's Japes. But I'll try Kega Fusion. And, um, well, here it is. See, it says Mr. Needle Mouse. Here it is. Yep, there it is. Sonic versus Danny DeVito. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, it's corruptions without the corruptor. Let's just. Let's just call it a night there. But actually, we don't have to call it a night. It's still a little early. Just a little bit. Well, early. It's over fucking 2 a.m. But I have one more thing that I want to do, which um, you might enjoy.